Russia, a nation of close to 144 million people with more than over 5,000 elective positions, only one black politician in the history of the country has been elected, Jean Sagbo, a Russian who was born and brought up in Benin. And most of the people who do not like Russia simply do not understand it. Uh, they have not taken enough time uh, or use some other resources to, to, try, to, to try to understand what Russia is all about. But I love Russia. So how did he get into politics in Russia? I'm a politician. Even in my previous life in Benin, I was always a rebel. I took an active part in the political processes in Benin. Uh, I'm a revolutionary, in a sense. His ties and love for the country are based on much more than his wife and children. It is also tied to the assistance offered to him at a time of need when his native Benin persecuted him. Uh, I completed my studies in 1984, after which I went back to Benin, my country. Uh, but upon arrival, I was arrested because of my political beliefs, and I spent a total of three years in detention. Uh, somehow, the Russians got to know about this, and uh, they helped in uh, securing my release and helped me to come back to Russia. That's how I came back here. As the first black man to be elected as counselor in Russia, many comparisons have been drawn to Barack Obama, the first democratically elected African-American president of the United States of America. However, Jean Sagbo prefers to make the distinction clear. When the time that I was elected, people would walk up to me and call me the local Obama. At first, that was flattering. But later, I stopped perceiving that as a compliment because Obama, as the U.S. president, behaved more like a typical U.S. president, not as son of Africa. During his term in office, the situation in Africa, for example, deteriorated further. We spoke to some Russians who voted for him to find out how his performance has been. He was very different from all other deputies that we had. It is for the first time I have ever seen such openness and outgoingness. Uh, you can really appreciate him at any time, call with any question, and Jean always helped and actually provided answers and was a positive and open person. Uh, Jean has done a lot here, he has done a lot of good things, many people like him, uh, but like any other person he's got his own shortcomings also. There are people who do not like him, who consider him to be overzealous. Most people are not used to that, that kind of style. After spending the day with residents from this little town in Russia, it's clear to see that the first black Russian to be elected as councillor is delivering on his promises. Mukami Wambora reporting for Citizen TV in Zobidovo.